Hello. Can you all hear me okay? Can you see me okay? Can you hear the game? a while for me to go live. Can you hear me okay? Am I too loud? It looks like I might be. for subscribing and becoming a new member of the Cat Gang and Kevlar Giraffe. Thank you for the 10 months. I don't know who Pesky is. Unless, unless that's supposed to say Pesci, as in Joe Pesci, in which case, yes, I can absolutely cosplay Joe Pesci. I would be on it. No intro, yeah. two babies to watch in this house. <laughs> um, Erin, for any of you who have been uh, following her extravaganza, Erin um, had more like potentially false not contractions, but just another situation where she was like, am I having a baby? And they were like, I don't know, you should probably come in. So... So yeah, we're just, we're chilling. Game louder than you. How's that? Is that better? I don't know where you are right now, but hello from Lincoln. Hi. Thank you, Peach Macaron. Thank you for the 10 months. Cat Dragon Rose, thank you for the 18. Dusty Scabbard, thank you for the two. I just got one of your house cat hoodies, and I love the design. Thank you. Closer says thank you for the 51 months. And Psycho Wolf Girl, thank you for the 27. flew into Lincoln, but my my flight was... So there were so many things that made us think that this trip was not going to happen. Baby girl and I were feeling sick halfway through the week. So I was like, if we're still sick by the time we're supposed to get on a plane, I'm not taking a, my sick baby on a plane, right? Aaron has been having false contractions for over a week. So we were like, baby might pop out. I don't know. Um... And there's a snowstorm. <laughs> so this morning I had a text that was like, hey, your flight got canceled. And I was like, oh. But then it said, we booked you on a new flight and it was the exact same flight. So confusing. I was like, okay. <laughs> and then we, the first flight landed in Denver. Baby girl was great for it. And, um... So I was like, sorry, I'll finish my story. So I was like, okay, it said that it booked me on a new flight, right? But if I looked it up anywhere, it said that the flight was canceled or that the flight didn't exist at all. And I was like, great, 
awesome. So I had to go to like a kiosk inside of the airport and recheck in in order for it to tell me where I was supposed to go because none of the boards, nothing said that this flight existed. And the Denver airport is, is long. It's basically just like a really long airport. So I, we landed at gate like 35 and by the time I find, and I had a half an hour connection, right? So it was already tight. We landed gate 35 and, um, I like found a kiosk to figure out my shit because the customer service line was long. So I was like, if I stand in this line, I'm missing the flight, right? If the flight exists, I'm missing it. So I'm going to use the kiosk and see if it helps. And it was like, here's your flight that we rebooked you on. It's at gate 95. <laughs> so I was like, oh, fuck. So then it was me running across the Denver airport with a stroller. <laughs> My baby's dead asleep. Just like, <sighs> there was one point where I hit a bump while running and she was like, <gasps> and like spit out her binky, like was just... <laughs> Fucking, you know when you spook a kitten and they do this? That was my baby. Just, <laughs> like, pacifier flung across the room. I was like, oh, no! Um, yeah, but the flight existed. I made it on the flight. She screamed for the second flight, the entire thing. And it was a very small plane. But everyone who was on it was very nice. There was an old lady who, was, who when we got out, there was an old lady who was like, were you who I heard the whole flight? And I was like, yeah, she's having some teething problems and things like that. So, and you know, she's been on two planes today. It's been a long day. She's barely napped. And the lady was like, you know, I had never been on a flight with a baby and people always complain about it. And that was a pretty small plane. So I think everybody probably heard her, but I have to say that that was not that bad. And people need to just mind their own business. <laughs> I was like, thank you. But I told that story to Erin and Erin was laughing because she then followed it up with a story of when um, she took Kaylee on a plane and Kaylee was screaming so loud that when they would do the announcements, you could hear Kaylee through, <laughs> through the receiver. <laughs> so anytime they made an announcement, you could hear a baby screaming. <laughs> And I was like, mm, <laughs> I can see why that would be a different situation. <laughs> the best part is that the reason she was screaming was because she wanted to lay on the floor. And they were like, I'm sorry, you can't lay on the floor. Like, you ha she has to be buckled in for takeoff. So she screamed. So she screamed and 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 screamed until they were in the air and then they were like fine just put her on the fucking floor <laughs> like <laughs> like can you imagine oh god what am i doing in nebraska so um a couple of my best friends aaron and david they are having their second baby Aaron is the one that I do manga pod with. David is um, my business partner for the coffee company. And um, they're about to have their second baby. And I kept saying, I want to visit you before you have the baby. I want to visit before you have the baby. I want to visit before you have the baby. And now, like, they're literally about to have the baby. Like, Aaron's been having false contractions. They have a C-section scheduled. But, like, it could show up at any time, right? And um, so I was like, can can I still visit or is it too close? And they were like, we would love to have you. Just be aware that like, while you're here, we might just pop out a child. We don't know. So um, yeah, so Clark and I are visiting. Kaylee loves Clark. Kaylee is their firstborn. Kaylee's three and she loves Clark. So um, yeah, so it's, it's fun. <gasps> Aaron and David are in chat. Hi, my name is David and happily Aaron are my are my lovely friendos oh also to any of you who are like what's up with the waffle thing because i was saying that i got an awkward waffle we went to a boba place after dinner tonight and i was like what is that smell it smells amazing and aaron was like oh they make waffles here and i was like i really want one of those waffles <laughs> so 
I got a bo- I got a boba tea and an egg butter waffle. <laughs> they, they, they gave me the sack. They literally made the waffle and then just threw it in the bag. They literally made the waffle and just threw it in a, in a brown bag and handed it to us. <laughs> and it wasn't until we got to the car that I was like, that seems like a weird way to transport a waffle. And I looked inside and it was just like a crumpled up waffle just like sitting in a bag. Hilarious. Still, it was delicious. <laughs> it was like, just waffle to go, I guess. <laughs> oh, shit. They have boba tea in Nebraska. Not much of it, but they do have it. Aaron is a boba tea fiend. So when they moved back here, after living in LA for a while, when they moved back here and was like, I must find the boba tea. <laughs> I really like the lighting. Thank you. Um, so there's some there's some Dodger coffee right there. And there's also on this side um the 100,000 subscribers game the game station play button. For any of you who watched the game station before it was rebranded. Um there's also an Isaiah body pillow that Aaron put up for us. It makes me laugh that you can't see his head. And I'm not changing it. <laughs> so, there's that. Did you like Nebraska when you visited? I mean, I'm here right now. And it's covered in snow. So, it's, I mean, it seems all right. <laughs> okay. Um, this is my time of Portia. That's me. And, um, fuck, what's the name of the girl that we hate in this one? It's not Sammy. That's the other game. Hold on. We're gonna find her. Because she sucks. Wait. Uh, I'm trying to remember. Did this game have motion blur? It does. Yeah. Um. Let me know how it looks while we're playing it. There she is, this bitch. I need you all to know who we're trying to take down here. It doesn't look great on OBS. Emily. She sucks. Oh no, our relationship went up. How about those planter boxes? I'm not going to explain why we hate her, because it's a long story. Frame rate looks low. Maybe don't lock frames. Ooh, that looks way worse. Ugh. Yeah, that's bad. Yeah, Emily sucks. She doesn't know what she wants. And she talks shit. That's all you need to know. Fuck, yeah, it looks terrible. Yeah, David, don't worry. I think it's just the settings. Hold on. Change to a higher refresh rate.
Oh, resolu- oh, oh shit, right here. It's like just really choppy. Why is that? I'm choppy though too. done something here. Everything is like upset. Hold on. Okay. I'm fine now. Hold on just a sec. I'll be right back. Yeah, thanks. Got it. <laughs> hmm. Everything's just like slow. It looks fine on mine. It doesn't look okay on OBS. So. But it looks fine for me. Darling, no. Go back to sleep. I love you. This isn't my computer, or my internet, or my OBS. <laughs> I'm using David's. The internet is incredible here, so it's not the internet. That's why I turned everything off, is because I was double checking the OBS settings, but everything's fine. If I tab off of the game, my webcam looks fine. It's when I, it's when I click the game. So maybe I do need to turn something down in OBS. Game capture, display capture? It's game capture. Should I try display capture instead, you think? Um, hold on. Hold on then. Okay. So far it looks better. I'm still stuttery though.
Sorry, my daughter's making a ruckus. Might just do normal windowed. That's not gonna work. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I'll be right back. I guess this is what we're doing now. <laughs> no matter what I did, um, it looked like a train wreck. I changed all kinds of stuff. So... <laughs> we'll try again some other time, I guess. <laughs> Minesweeper Pog, dude. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, hold on just a second. Why is this? Why is there a delay? Ba ba ba. There we go. That's a bit better. What was I gonna do? I was going to change the game because right now it says we're playing something else. Minesweeper Pog, dude. Okay. Here it is. Bam. Oops. I guess the Bob object. I just need to check my mouth flat. That's all. How's the tattoo feeling? It's okay. It um, got really hot on the plane. And um, so, you know. <laughs> David helped me uh, put a bunch of lotion all over it <laughs> before they left. <laughs> Which one? Which one's yelling? Neither? Apparently they're both fine? Great. Both babies still asleep. I'm doing my job. <laughs> um, Willard Mittens, thank you for the 28 months. Sir Jenks for the 28 months as well. Um, Leandro, Leandro DLC, thank you for the two months. I entered Twitch randomly and here you are. Sadly, I have to go somewhere else, but I want to send you and chat some love. Aw, thank you. Ardark, thank you for the 29 months. Shifty Monk for the 28th. River Rat, thank you so much for subscribing. The New Wit, thank you so much for the 30. Mekif, thank you for the 23. Yorick the Skull for the 14. Brimstone, thank you for the 20. Turtle Sushi, thank you for gifting a sub to Mule Spotter. Relief, thank you for the 33. And Man, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a new member of the Capital Gun Girl. Should we give up on Porsche? Yeah, no matter what I did, it wasn't looking right. So, fuck it. We're playing Minesweeper. Pog, dude. Can we have snow for the background? No. There's corn in the background. I'm in Nebraska. Home of the Huskers. 
How dare you? <laughs> um, that has to be. We didn't want Emily's shit anyway. Fair. <gasps> David, can I use your Spotify? Ah, Dodgers Dexterity Tunes. Here we go. That's what's up. That's what I am talking about. Yeah, but I only have your playlist. Perfect. <laughs> Corn music. Yeah, you know. Let me know if that's a good level. Um... Okay, that has to be... Good? Sick? Polo Yart! Thank you so much for gifting some subs to Professor Strawberries, Bentleys, um, UO, Drax the Lurker, and Dragonlord159. All of you, welcome to the cat gang. Be sure to thank Polo Yart. P-O-L-U-Y-A-R-T. You can't see what I'm doing. Yuck, 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 yuck. Yuck, 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 yuck. Wow. <laughs> okay. One of those has to be, one of these has to be, so that's not. <laughs> oh my god, can I tell you guys another story though? <laughs> so, um, <laughs> I wanted a cup of coffee because I had a big day and I was like, I need to wake up a little bit if I'm gonna stream. And, um, so Aaron and David made me coffee, sweethearts. Erin opens up the cupboard where the mugs are, and she said, go ahead and pick one. And David goes, there's a very obvious mug that is the Dodger mug. So I grabbed this one. Literally, first, first mug that I saw, I was like, oh, he obviously means this. It says, here's a cup of Calm the Fox Down. Right? Classic mug goof for my house. I was like, this one, right? <laughs> and David was like, no, the Dodger coffee mug, the, your mug, the Dodger coffee branded mug. <laughs> it's like, oh, oh. <laughs> okay, what are we fucking doing here? One, two, three, bam, bam, bam. That's done, that's done. Done, done. One, two, three, done. One, two, three, four. So all of those are clear, that's clear, that's done, done. That's clear. Those are clear. That's clear. One, two, bam. One, two, bam, bam. Bam.
great. <laughs> The only person playing Minesweeper on Twitch? That can't be true. Why wouldn't anyone want to play the literal best game ever made? <laughs> I'm too big also. Hold on. I'm covering up so much of the gameplay. Here we go. That's better. <laughs> this is like sometimes when I <laughs> Sometimes when I go to watch Jesse's streams, I've said this before, but sometimes when I go to watch Jesse's streams, I'm like, oh, he's not using face cam today, but he is. where I'm meant to be. You're right. But then what do I do when I win? I say with confidence. But then what do I do when I win? <laughs> I have no sunglasses to put on. with your filters. No, I don't I don't have sunglasses. three left. One. Two.
again. Sweeper paw, dude. <laughs> so fucking funny to me. <laughs> I was looking at you and then I started laughing so hard. Because <laughs> I was like, this is supposed to be a goof, but this is my real life. That side's all done. <laughs> Finally got me, Bill. What? what? The Clark Street Crater, the mother of all potholes. Oh. Yeah, year after rim-wrecking year, it tormented the people of this town. They try to fill it, it <laughs> always returns. It got me good. That's... But you know, State Farm's got you too. More likely you than you think. It? You ain't nothing! You trash-talking a pothole? Yes. Yes, I am. Go with the one that's here to help <gasps> life go right. State Farm. Talk to an agent today. When you're selling online, 
It's exciting to watch the orbs flow in. What's not so exciting? More ads, Check hell yeah. <laughs> That's why you need ShipStation, the number one choice of online sellers. ShipStation automatically imports all of your orders into one simple interface, so you can easily create shipping labels for all the top carriers at the lowest rates. Now, try ShipStation free for 30 days. Plus, Spotify listeners can get it for free. Click on the banner or go to ShipStation.com, click on the microphone, and enter Spotify. Here we go. Oh, I have a text. The stream could not be more embarrassing for me. David, there's nothing to be embarrassed about. <laughs> also, the text messages that I had were from David trying to help us figure out the stream. Very sweet. And also one from Sam that was that emoji face that's like blowing out air through the nose because I was telling him how amazing your guys' house is. <laughs> and he was like... <laughs> I was like, honey, their house is so cool. how that had to be. I don't think it is. I don't think that's a rule. I think I just went for it. <laughs> Actually playing Minesweeper, I am. I'm gonna read my <laughs> rebuild my computer until that damn farm game has all its frames. <laughs> we'll figure it out, bud. We'll figure it out. And if not, it's fine. I don't have to play farm games while I'm here. Belch Belch, thank you so much for subscribing. Draylin for the 14 months. Stay hydrated, my dude. Thank you for the 7. Kettlecorn for the 18. Warsinger for the 3. Ultra ILT, thank you for the 26. This is actually the most relaxing thing I've seen all day. I try. Cordry, thank you for the 52. And Kusajin, thank you for the 4. Trying to figure out if there's anything that I'm not taking into account here. There are eight bombs left. So say it's... Oh. One. Two. Three. There's still like a bunch in here. Oops. Which makes me think it might be. 
more like that. Fuck it, let's find out. Yep, it is. Cool. And then... Either that one or that one. I think. No, that's not necessarily true. No, it could be that one and that one. Or it could just be that one. sweeper? I've never heard of that. Or have I? Oh god, no, I'm not sure. <laughs> The game saved my ass there. It was on autopilot. <laughs> 
shit. Seven left. They're all in that corner. <sighs> Go shoot. No. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I accidentally hit the back button. <laughs> so we're playing a browser version. God damn it. I was I was feeling good about that one. Oh well, what can you do? What can you do, fam? Nothing. Can't do shit. Except play more Minesweeper. Damn, that's Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Thank you. 
Didn't get what you wanted for the holidays? Then head to T-Mobile and pick out something you'll really be excited about, like the Samsung Galaxy S9. Check out all the deals at T-Mobile.com or visit a store today. <laughs> Here's a real post from a real Chick-fil-A guest. At our Foodie Ventures writes, Quick lunch today. A Chick-fil-A grilled chicken club sandwich never disappoints. Chicken yeah, emoji, licking true. lips emoji. Thanks, our foodie ventures. Glad Chick Fil A could be part of your ventures. It's the little things that make our grilled chicken club sandwich worth the trip, like the backyard grilled flavor in every bite. Also, did we mention it has bacon? Insert Sounds bacon like a commercial that Whoops Share your would make. At Chick Fil A with hashtag the little things. Have you been to Chick Fil A recently? Oh, Smile. You know how late night noises can keep you up. <laughs> There's the rumble of snoring, the clatter of road work, the ruckus from neighbors. So we developed Bose Noise Masking Sleep Buds. This unique innovation covers irritating <laughs> nighttime noises with soothing sounds. Just choose a preloaded sound, put in the tiny earbuds, and sleep better. Learn more about Bose Noise Honestly, Masking Honestly, I don't mind the ads. <laughs> also available at Amazon. It adds some flavor text. <laughs> Oh, good lord. The ads are great content, right? I feel like we should just do this now so that if we fuck it up, we're not wasting a bunch of time on the rest. Great. <laughs> You wouldn't hire me to find your mines? You might not have a choice, motherfucker. This place is gonna explode in five minutes. Who are you gonna choose? Some yay who ha who's never played Minesweeper? Or the yay who who's played a lot of Minesweeper? <laughs> Neither of us are gonna find the mines, but like, who has a better shot at it, you know? I think there's an obvious answer. <laughs> with all these fucking threes out here. I die.
I was all worried about what I was gonna do when I won a game. How's I gonna celebrate it? I don't have any sunglasses. And yet here we are. <laughs> I haven't won a single game. Hell yeah. This is one of my favorite video game songs of all time. For sure. I used to play Simon's Quest with my brother all the time. And I was obsessed with it because it freaked me out. Like, it really spooked me. <laughs> so I loved it. He was like, oh, we're in Haiti now. I just woke up and we're in Haiti. <laughs> My brother's a musician, so he goes like all over the place playing music. And he um, sometimes works on jazz cruises. So you can go on, you know, like the, the metal cruise that TV used to go on. There's like a jazz versions of that where you can just like be on a cruise ship and listen to good jazz music like the whole time. And um, so my brother will, will play music on jazz cruises sometimes. And so he was like, yeah, I just woke up and I'm in Haiti. <laughs> this is a Castlevania song. Sick.
Do the jazz crews and metal crews have epic battles on the high seas? I doubt it. I feel like they probably stick to their own waters. If I had to guess. Tattoo is scabbed over. It's so tight. You know, like when you when you get a scab, it like pulls at the skin a little bit. So there's just like tiny scabs everywhere, and the whole my whole arm just feels so tight. We did put lotion on it, and it felt amazing. So heckin' cool when it heals. I know, man. All the like really small lines um, on the flower are really interesting because it it looks like I'm trying to think of what it looks like, but it feels it feels like I should be able to just like pick a piece off and just like pull the whole thing off. I don't know. I don't know how to put it. It's weird. Is there a world where this is something? Yeah, could be. Yeah, I think any of this is on the table, I think. Producers of Avatar bring you the IMAX 3D event of the year. On February 14th, discover a bold new world and a brave new hero. I do not stand by in the presence of evil. Alita Battle Angel on February 14th. Fuck yeah. State Farm, this is Alita. Bill. Finally got me, Bill. What's that, Rick? The Clark Street Crater, the cool. mother of all <laughs> potholes. Oh. Yeah, year after rim-wrecking year, it tormented the people of this town. They tried to fill it, but it always returns. It got me good. But you know, State Farm's got you too. You hear that? You ain't nothing! You trash talking a pothole? Yes. Yes, I am. <laughs> go with the one that's here to help life <gasps> go right. What? State Farm. State Farm. An agent today.
Can you get some dude cools in chat? Hate that the current channel's emotes aren't at the top of the list on mobile. Me too. I think the the way that they have emote search set up, both on desktop and on mobile, is kind of screwy. <laughs> I like that on mobile, I like that on mobile, it shows my most recently used emotes at the top. I like that. But then I have to scroll forever to find the emotes for the channel that I'm actually on. Not great. And then on desktop, I like that it's really easy to find the emotes for the channel that I'm currently on, but there isn't a these are the emotes you used recently list because I think they find it unnecessary because you can just search. You can just, I could t just type in like Doog and then it'll bring up all of my emotes. But. Your favorite emotes? Does it really? God, remember my terrible waffle? 
It was actually really good, though. I can't say it was a terrible waffle. Just an odd waffle experience, you know? Okay, so that's clear. Okay, so because of this one, we know that this is one, two, three, four, five. And we also know that's clear. Maybe we already knew that. I didn't know that. It was an awful waffle. <laughs> 14 mines left. I have no idea how to play this, but I like watching you do it. Um, so the numbers that you find correspond to how many mines they're touching. So say that I clicked and I saw this one here. That would mean that all of the surrounding blocks, so there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight squares around. Any of those could be a mine. And depending on the number that you see, there's one mine or two mines or three mines. You're trying to use the numbers to logic your way through where all of the mines are. This number over here is how many seconds it's taken you to do it. We ignore that because who cares? And then this number is how many mines are left. Does that help? Hold on, let me read an order. Evil Dr. Catfish, thank you for the 27 months. Um, no Seth Bend, thank you so much for the biddies. Angel Omnipotent, Angel Omnipotent, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a new member of the Cat Gang. Ruckbar, thank you so much for subscribing. Ovi Bear, thank you for subscribing. All of you, welcome to the Cat Gang. Orion Blarg, thank you for the 43. Kendra for the nine, happy Twitch baby. Fid Tech, thank you for the 31. Sophie Saws for the 10. Erogami Chan, thank you for the 13. Sino Messer for the 14. Miss Michelle Jean for the 26. The Emperor Pigeon, thank you so much for subscribing. And Arnar, thank you so much for gifting subs to Flawless Happiness, Hayden56, Techo8, 31ite, and Wandering J. All of you welcome to the cat game. Be sure to thank Arnar in chat for those. Thank you. Waiting for the Duger competitive Minesweeper tourney. <laughs> now, when I see like how quick people who are really good at Minesweeper, when I see how fast they do it, I'm like, <laughs> I enjoy playing Minesweeper a lot. Could I compete at Minesweeper? Not even a little. Two mines left. Well, one is somewhere in here. And then two has got to be the last fulfillment for the four. So that's going to be clear. So that's only touching 
the mine that's here, so that's also clear. Again, only touching the mine that's there, so one, two, three, four. Can we get some Duke Cools in chat, please? Two wins in a row, hell yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> ruined my streak. It happened so fast. That's what I'm right here. Oh, you're already touching three. Hell yeah, there we go. There's usually something I'm overlooking.
Why is there corn in the back? Because I'm in Nebraska, home of the corn huskers. Do you plan on playing Solitaire next? I got my fill of Solitaire growing up, I think. God, you know what I do want to try, though, is, um... Is there, like, a... In Final Fantasy XIV, they added new games to Golden Saucer, and one of them is Mahjong, like, legit Mahjong. Do they tell you how to play it? Or are they just like, hope you know how to play Mahjong, bitch? Fuck! Off! No! I did it again! So mad, god damn it. <laughs> There's a side button on here that acts as a back button, and I keep hitting it with my finger, but I think. Huge written tutorial. Oh, interesting.
Isn't Mahjong literally find a pair? Not actual Mahjong, no. Mahjong, the Mahjong that we've like played on Windows since we were kids is not the same as actual Mahjong. <laughs> Yo, if it was, I would be crushing that game. <laughs> Took that guess. That was stupid. But that's okay. <laughs> I'm out of it now, boys. Regicide? Wait, when when did we get on to regicide in <laughs> chat? <laughs> what the fuck is happening out here? How are our babies doing? Mine died. Oh no. She yelling. She yelling and I didn't know because it died. BRB. There we go. Jesus. Did you guys hear anything that I said while I was gone? No? What the fuck? How did it... 
Oh, whatever. Um, she was just like screaming, 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 screaming because she's used to having a bumper in the crib. Um, and so it's a lot easier when there isn't a bumper to chuck the pacifier. And so she lost her pacifier and was screaming, but I didn't realize because the monitor was off. So by the time we turned the monitor on, hello, um, baby Clark might have woken up baby Kaylee. Oh, no. I know. Wow. Look at what you, you're so professional now. It's David. It's so professional. Everybody say hi. <laughs> Aaron's going to come in too. <gasps> Marie Marie. Yeah. I like both of you a lot. You like you. Oh, sick. How's she doing? Good, good, good. Good. Hold on. I'll make us bigger I than think baby you says. Yeah? And I. Yeah? I think a straight up head-to-head -head mind sweep or battle. Sure. Would be epic. Yeah, let's do it. I finally found someone and I feel maybe on par. <laughs> <laughs> you may, you may. You may be able to, to take, take me. I don't yeah. even know, yeah. How do you even battle in Minesweeper? I don't know. I think what we'd have to do is a very <laughs> overly complicated system of like dozens, click at a dozens time. of games <laughs> recording time. Oh no! And and wins. I don't know. I, time and I'm not good with and time. Mine's left. The problem. Okay, just mine's left. Mine's left. Okay. But see, because you know, there's some luck, so sure. you can't just do. Hi. One. There she is. Oh, the dogs are here? Whoa. Dude, he's got like a hi, demon eye. Right? He's got his demon eye okay. going. Uh, <gasps> yay! Family! The whole family's bam. here. Bam, bam. And doggos. It's amazing. Bam. How are you feeling? You okay? Yes. Good. Still pregnant. Still pregnant. Baby did not come out in the last couple of hours. Yeah, that's what we were doing. The positive. <laughs> Just popping out, popping out a child, you know. It's like I... false alarm number. What is that? Five? No time. I don't know. <laughs> Hospital trip number five, at least. We've gone once a week for the last six weeks. Once and like twice. Yikes. So, oh yeah, there yeah. it is. There's, <laughs> there's, like there's there. a baby in there. There's still baby in there. Yeah. There. I fixed the branding. <sighs> oh, thank God. <laughs> I'm blocking the. Blocking the TV? That's true. The play button? Yeah, it's blocking the play button. Look, that's that, that's history, okay? This that is, is history. today. That's that's, that's for the true fans. Yeah, that's right. for the people who know. <laughs> Can I say how impressive you are at this game? Because I'm not. Good. Thank you. I've never once successfully really played God, this I, game. <laughs> I love mine. I've gotten a lot better at Minesweeper from streaming it though. Oh really? Yeah, mm -hmm. because when I would struggle. I would say, okay, like, what's an area that I should be able to figure out? And I would just kind of, like, head bash it until I figured it out. Or somebody would be like, you know, this is actually a rule that you should keep in mind in the future. So. You're really good at um, finding finding the one that isn't uh, clear from the numbers. So, like, when there's, like, uh, like... It has to be these two, so this one must not be one. Oh, You're really good at finding those. Thank you. Yeah. I like finding the... I like... I have a bunch of patterns I've memorized, like the one, two, one, two, one. Sure. Oh, those are... I love those. That's just like, I boom, love, boom, boom. I the, love that I shit. I see three right there. Boom. You're see, gone. That just stresses me out. <laughs> I see numbers, and it just freaks me out. But, like, you, you really do, like, find patterns. So, yeah. like, like, a three... That yeah. is just up a against a wall. Three. Yeah, there they all are. Those that has to be it because there's nothing else going on nope. that scares you. <laughs> nope, can't do it. By the way, did the Spotify ads go away? Oh, I made, they might have. I made Aaron. <laughs> you made me I made Aaron, my family <laughs> premium. <laughs> I made Aaron upgrade to a family <laughs> plan and put my account on it. Amazing. <laughs> That's add me. <laughs> Aaron's like getting examined. I'm like, get me on your Spotify yeah, account. I'm like, fucking up. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, Twitch is wild. You can just watch people talk about Minesweeper. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Ripped a State Farm. <laughs> <laughs> State Farm. Yeah. 
State Farm guy, dead. Poor Chick-fil-A. Dead to us. Poor Chick-fil-A. Oh. <laughs> no more T-Mobile. No more T-Mobile. What's going on with this thing? So sad. Oh, uh, with the farm game? I don't know. It's a new game. Not not new, but it was in early access for a long time, and it was finally released. So I don't know if there's like an optimization, whatever. But it runs okay on. I wonder if it's a new graphics card. Not... I'm gonna check my drivers Maybe? and stuff. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. I was telling them when I was having issues streaming Overwatch, where it was like, <laughs> just did it. yeah, I know. I sat down. Get away from me, dog. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm in here. Yeah, I don't know if you can see it, but this leg had a it's dog. All <laughs> head. Um, when I was trying to stream Overwatch and I was lagging, I changed the like streaming codec. That's what I, I tried doing that too. Yeah, go. it was the same, unfortunately. Boo. Boo. This is Dicky, and mm. the other one is Derp. They came with both of those names. Yes. They were both rescues, and they had those names already. Yes. Which is just so good. And Dicky's the favorite. <laughs> They're both precious no, no, puppies. No, no, no. I'm just kidding. Clark was but... chasing them around the house. Oh my god, that was so cute. <laughs> she gets so happy with dogs. She loves I love dogs. I She's know. just like. <laughs> It's so cute. It's hilarious because Kaylee, like, gets gets really excited with Clark and wants Clark to like do all of these things, and so she'll be like, "Clark, do this. Clark, do this." Which, aside from the fact that she doesn't understand English and doesn't know what Kaylee's asking her to do, she also was way more interested in just following the dogs everywhere <laughs> than doing what Kaylee wanted her to do. And it was really funny. She needs to go in my tent, and I'm like, she's. She's playing with the doggies, but she needs to go in my tent so I can sing to her. My favorite one was <laughs> Kaylee, Kaylee being like, get in the sleeping bag, Clark. I want to show you something. Get into the sleeping bag. <laughs> over and, and, over. and Clark's just like mouth on like a toy like chair. Just like, ah. <laughs> like, Kaylee's like, come here, Clark. I want to show you something. She's like, ah. <laughs> and Kaylee doesn't quite understand the age yet. <laughs> And then she would look at me and go, can you put her in the sleeping bag? And I was like, well, she doesn't really, she's been laying down for a long time today, so she probably likes moving around. And then she would sit there for a second and go, can you put her in the sleeping bag? Like, just ask her kids. Sometimes she'll go, she'll be like, I think she needs to go in the sleeping bag. Like, right. that's how she'll word it. Yeah. I think she needs to do this. She's trying to figure it out. Yeah, yeah. Her three-year-old brain just doesn't understand. She just wants to play with the sleeping bag. Um, Kaylee, Kaylee has a, a baby doll, and I asked how old the baby was, and she said, three. And I said, oh, how old are you? And she goes, three. And I love the, the like, lapse in logic there. Yeah. Of, like, I'm a three-year-old, and I have an itty-bitty baby doll, and we're the same age. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, yeah. Same age. The other thing is because Kaylee's been, like, continually saying like it's gonna be my birthday soon and we're like this is gonna be a little bit <laughs> Yikes, and then and then months? now she's transferred it to her baby doll it's about to be her birthday right like, she wants a birthday party right. okay can someone please have a birthday <laughs> so birthday that kaylee cake. can have a birthday, birthday party. Cake. i mean you could have a, a zero birthday yeah. when the baby's born no. I like now that no. No. she... We're not going to cave to Kaylee's <laughs> demands for when birthday she... parties. When she throws her baby doll birthday party now, she makes her a cake. But David doesn't get any cake because David doesn't like cake. Yeah. No, no, no. So... You went upstairs and she was like, Daddy, I'm going to make you cake. And David was like, I don't want cake. And she was like, but it's my cake. And he was like, I don't know how that changes things. <laughs> And she was like, I'm going to put sprinkles on it. And he was like, well, I do like sprinkles, but I don't like cake. And she was like, but I'm making a cake. <laughs> he was just so insistent. And David kept every single time. Like, he wouldn't cake. He kept being like, I don't want cake, I'm not going to eat your fake imaginary cake, dumb kid. I said no. Get in your head. Um, my favorite part is that her, her cake was uh, plastic potato, potato chips. chips and cheese. Mm -hmm. Those were yeah. the things in the bowl that she was making yeah. cake with. <laughs> and then she'd dump it on the plate and all these chips would just go. <laughs> so good. The real, so good. The real reason I'm not just eating her cake when she asked me to is she needs like, she needs more people telling her no. Right. In life. Instead of just, like, like she just steamrolls like so many people. She just rolled. <laughs> Do you feel like that's a, a you 
quality. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> so, so I'm like, okay. So you'll steamroll right back. Well. <laughs> no, Kaylee. <laughs> I'm not eating your stupid cake. Imaginary cake. The problem is, is Aaron's side of the family is so nice. That's that what Sam says to she me just all the time. crushes them. Like, Aaron's mom is like Kaylee's slave when Kaylee is like in playtime. She just like will not say no to her, will not like even stick up for herself. Like, Kaylee's just like a bully sometimes. It's just she like, bullies her grandma. it's like, you cannot talk to your grandma like that, Kaylee. Yeah. There's a lot of me being like, Kaylee, how do we talk to people right. nicely? Kaylee's mom comes out of this session just like, Back my mom's like, <laughs> there was one like, one of my favorite kid. like Kaylee things is that she likes to put people down for naps. So she likes to lay people down and then pat like put blankets I on love that. and pat. And so one of the days my mom was washing her a few days ago, and we have our staircase, and so it like goes like this and then up, and mm. so there's a little space. My mom was like curled around like in this little ball because that's where Kaylee decided nap time was. <laughs> And had this like baby blanket on my mom, and is just sitting there patting. And anytime my mom would open her eyes, Kaylee goes, "Shh, it's nap time. You have to sleep. Like it's sleep time." And so my mom was just laying there, like she wasn't like, being like, "Maybe I shouldn't do this." Right. My she's, nap is over. She's laying on the ground with her eyes closed. The because the three-year-old Kaylee has demanded. Shh. You need to sleep now. So like, Kaylee, funny. it's it's eleven a.m. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Held hostage by a toddler. <laughs> so good. She just knows what she wants. Uh, that's good advice. One parent must be the no giver. <laughs> oh yeah, totally. Hey, I've gotten very good at a lot yeah, of training actually... with you. Yeah gotten very good thank you i can tell my child no <laughs> it's just uh god it's a trip man mm. she's wild yeah <laughs> kids are crazy man it's great all right well should we let you get back to your sweeping of mind i'm i'm just gonna finish this game and then i think i'm gonna call it because it's midnight here yeah whatever yeah <laughs> <laughs> and then i can give you back your I'm gonna, and then I can figure out what, these frames. <laughs> I was like, it's like maybe you could do it tomorrow. And then I said, no, because you're going to lay in bed for two hours and then come up and do it anyway. <laughs> so I was like, if I don't do it tonight, yeah. I'm going to think about it all night. <laughs> Everybody say bye-bye. Bye. 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 Oh, good night. Oh, oh, good night. Oh, I love you. Oh, I love you guys. No, I love you. See you in the morning. Okay. Bye, puppies. Love you. <laughs> Cuties. Cutie patooties. Too hot. Goddamn. Police and the fireman. Too hot. Goddamn. Makes you want to retire, man. Too hot. Goddamn. I thought we would get to keep the dog. <laughs> Say my name, you know who I am. Oh, baby girl. I'm going to have to wean her off of the... Oh, Spotify's closed. Interesting. I'm going to have to wean her off of... Um... The pacifier soon. Not soon, but like... She can't sleep without it. And everyone that I know whose kids use a pacifier is like, make sure <laughs> that they're not using it anymore by the time they can talk because then it's way harder to get rid of it. <laughs> because then they can ask for it. Be like, mommy, where's my binky? And then your heart will break. So, I have to do it before she can talk.
But as it is now, she doesn't... She doesn't use it very much when she's awake. I don't feel like... And she hasn't... We don't give it to her when she's just, like, awake and doing her thing, really. Um, and she hasn't, like, really gotten into, like, sucking on her thumb or anything like that. So I, I don't feel like it'll be extremely painful to wean her off of it. I think she'll just be mad. <laughs> So just be mad about it, which, fair, <laughs> you know? My mom weaned me off the pacifier and then I started sucking on my finger and I didn't stop until I was nine. I sucked my thumb for a really long time too. But that's what I'm saying. I don't I don't feel like she will because she doesn't have the inclination to do it during the day. Like she she literally only really uses it at night. She uses it during the day if she's like really struggling with teething stuff. Dr. Jazzfist, thank you for the 14 months. Arnar, thank you for gifting a sub to Alfredo is life. Welcome to the cat gang. Thank you, Arnar. Bagel, thank you for the biddies. Aguilegia, thank you so much for subscribing. Artist, thank you for the 13. Potato, thank you for gifting a sub to Free Bush. Welcome to the cat gang. And thank you. Bleh. Thank you, Potato. Bry the Lion, thank you for the six. Avi, thank you for gifting a sub to Angie. Welcome to your 11th month. And Metal Dane, thank you for the 34 months. best to just let her stop when she's ready. That's what my parents did to me. I don't, I don't know. I don't feel like there's necessarily anything. I don't know. People will probably argue with me about this, but I don't necessarily feel like there's something super traumatic about being like, we just don't use a binky anymore. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't know they say that it's fine until like all of their teeth are grown in right for the most part I had to hang my pacifier on the pacifier tree I don't know what that means Sam so both both Sam and I had like oral fixation shit um Sam literally like had multiple pacifiers that he would put in his mouth at once when he was a baby and his mom was like I don't know what to do <laughs> and wound up because he would have like four that he would try to like keep in his mouth all at the same time and so she, <laughs> this is like it's so extreme she um so she started one by one she would cut the like teat part off of the pacifier so he still had it but there was nothing for him to suck on so he would just he would like carry them around but they wouldn't do anything for him and eventually he would just stop carrying them that was like her that's how she dealt with it Sam always going all out, even as a baby, right? Like, what the fuck? But I, I sucked my thumb for a really long time. 
like way too long. But I think I turned out okay. <laughs> I don't think that it's like a huge deal if you do. It's just I rem I I was old enough that I remember it. You know, I remember sucking my thumb and thinking to myself, I shouldn't, like, I was old enough to think to myself, I shouldn't be sucking my thumb anymore. <laughs> so. I would rather avoid that if possible. Because I remember hating that feeling as a kid. So. If I can help her not do that. I will. Did you develop an overbite? I had I had a um a crossbite, but it corrected itself. So I was very lucky. But yeah, my teeth were crossed over oddly. And they were like, she might need braces. And then the next time I went in for a checkup, they were like, oh, never mind. <laughs> my parents were like, what? <laughs> Well, that's not what I meant to do, but that's okay. Maybe the thumb sucking did us some good. I didn't need braces either. <laughs> That's what they don't want you to know. There's no number? Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, I had miscounted. Definitely told David that was going to be my last game, and then I just kept playing like an asshole. Sorry, David. 
This will be my actual last game. <laughs> Actual last one. <laughs> I'm being careless. Hundred bits if dudes wins. Well, shit. A hundred bits if I win. A whole hundo bitty. Okay, then let's focus. Let's focus up. Oh my god. Oh god. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. Okay. No pressure. Oh god. Okay. Shit. All right. Okay. <laughs> so pressure now. I feel so much pressure. So much pressure. Da 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 da. Dun 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 da 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 da. 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 On the pressure. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
Gedanken. All right. Give me those dude cools and chat. <laughs> we did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Last game of the night. That's what's up. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the biddies, everybody. <laughs> Somebody said I was going to have a guess over on this side. But I didn't. Maybe they weren't taking into account the possibility that we could come from around the other side. <sighs> thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> um, Psychosis, thank you for the 26 months. And thank you, Dodge This Angie, Daryl Biggums, Stoltheim Reinbach. Our mutt, slap face, Shova Puma, Arnar, Gregel, and Carmen Gia Girl for the biddies, the winner biddies. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And Avi, thank you so much for gifting subs to Tekkenon, Great Bum, Savaro, Blue Myself, and Davey Fo Show. All of you, welcome to the Cat Gang. Be sure to thank Avi10 in chat for those. Thank you. And an anonymous gifter gifted a sub to Shaman Crit. Shaman Crit, welcome to the Cat Gang as well. Thank you guys. It's very generous of you. I appreciate it. I'm just glad. I'm just glad that I didn't uh, let you all down. <laughs> the second that I started seeing people being like, 
I will give all of my bits if Dodger wins. I was like, oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> um, okay, hold on. Hold on. Okay. Thank you so much today to They Might Be Mike, Canna Bananabalism, Charlemagne, River Rat, um, Turtle Sushi for gifting us out to Mule Spotter, to Man, um, all the people Polyart gifted subs to, Professor Strawberries, Bentley SB, UO, Drax the Lurker, and Dragon Lord. Thank you so much to Felch Belch, Angel Omnipotent, Ruck Bar, OV Bear, Obvi Bear, The Emperor Pigeon. Thank you so much to everybody uh, who was gifted a sub by Arnar, Flawless Happiness, Hayden, Teko, um, 31 Ite, Wandering J, Alfredo is Life. All of you, welcome. Um, Aguilegia, thank you so much for subscribing. Potato gifted a sub to Freebush. Welcome, Tekanon, Great Bum, Savaro, Blue Myself, Davy Faux Show to the Cat Gang. Avi gifted those subs. Thank you again, Avi. And Shaman Crit, welcome as well. Thank you so much to that anonymous gifter. Um, okay. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Glad that I got to slip some wins in there. I got the dubs. I got the W a few times. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be streaming tomorrow. But if I am, I'll tweet. And if I'm not, I'll tweet. How's that sound? <laughs> Have a fantastic day. Let's go raid Sam. I assume that he's still going. He and Tomato are playing pit people. And it's pretty funny. Oh yeah, they live. They live. Okay, we're raiding Sam. Go send him some dude cools because let's be real, we're cool as heck tonight. And uh, we'll see you next time. Okay, bye bye.